What's going on guys, Tall Fisherman J here and today we are doing another Lucky Tackle Box unboxing. Now this unboxing is for the Bass XL box and it is for the month of August. Now I am super hyped to get into this box because this month's theme is Big Fish Bait. So it pretty much means every bait in here is targeted to catch big fish fish so i'm excited to get in this i don't want to waste too much time let's go ahead dump everything out and go over it i am psyched really quick before i open this box i want to let you guys know that you can get five dollars off any lucky tackle box of your choice i will leave the link in the description below go ahead and click on that link and type in the code tall five and you will receive five dollars off your box it helps me out helps you out so definitely check it out link in description all right let's get in this what I'm going to do is open it up and just drop everything out. Okay, so I am like crazy, crazy excited. There is so many cool stuff in this box this month. But let me just go over really quick the reading material. As always, this little note from uh, Rick, the owner of LTB, explaining what's in the box, what's a what to expect from next month and as you can see the theme right here is big fish baits and that means most of the baits in here will catch some big old fish next is a little sheet that shows you what's in the box and how much it costs and as always fish hound magazine i always tell you guys take a moment check out this magazine it tells you what's in your box it tells you how to use it when to use it, it has really really good articles about what's inside so and it also has some kind of coupons sometimes so definitely check this out fish hound magazine definitely read up on it okay so to the baits i oh my god this is crazy i see a lot of cool stuff let me just jump into it uh first off simple stuff we have uh bait mate fish attractant nothing pretty crazy about this it smells really strong i put it on a lot of my lures it does work these are little sample packs that come in handy when you need it to put on like lures or something just to get that fish to hold on a bit longer and this stuff works so yeah bait me it's been in the box before and i love it so this kind of popped out to me uh it is the bait mate which is the same brand obviously that makes the attractant uh it's called ultra live baits next best thing to live bait and it is a worm now they look extremely similar to like earthworms it's literally as close as you can get to live bait without it being live bait i don't know if you guys can see in there but it has a bunch of fish attracted in there and they look just like earthworms it's ridiculous so a uh, fish would definitely get fooled for this um it's super realistic i'm actually going to use these instead of worms or i may do a comparison to live worms versus these uh in a future video just because I mean, it doesn't get any closer than this, you guys. This stuff is crazy. So these are the Nightcrawler, and they are four and a half inch. And that is that. That's pretty interesting. I'm going to use these for sure. Next up we have here is the Bass Attacker. Looks like lizards. And they say they are infused with bass fuel. I'm assuming that's some form of attractant. Let me smell this stuff here. <coughs> Holy crap. Well, it's... Uh, <laughs> it is really really strong the oh my god the scent is garlic scented and it is absurdly strong this stuff is like ridiculously strong um they are these black lizard lures i do like using these a lot um when i don't have much confidence using brush hogs i will always switch to a lizard these are in black and blue so this will work perfect for like murky canal waters snakeheads bass pretty much anything will destroy this pretty much your basic lizard i love it i will definitely keep this in my soft plastic box must have I have garlic stuff all over my hands next up is uh mustad one fourth ounce jig heads with the screw lock now i'm assuming these are to rig up your lizards so can't go wrong with these. They come in a pack of three. So there it is. Mustad jig head hooks. Next, we have something pretty interesting. Uh, it is the Trapper Tackle Hooks. Now, I know a lot of you guys have probably seen these 
on social media and stuff like that. And I actually had an opportunity to talk to them at iCast. There are these hooks. These are the uh, finesse finesse drop shot hooks and they're they're quite interesting they're not your typical hook that we're used to it has a different kind of offset to them i'm going to see if i can they're pretty small but i'm going to see if i can get it on camera as you can see it has that little lip there i don't know yeah you guys can see that pretty well it has a little lip there it's it's advertised to keep the fish on longer and stuff like that it's pretty interesting it's something that i haven't really seen before until they did it so i am digging it and it includes here a pack of two so yeah that is the trapper tackle finesse drop shot hook so these are interesting i have not had a chance to use these i actually have a set of treble hooks that have the same kind of design but in the future i will be using these and i will let you guys know how i like them I have a jenko fishing cd series crankbait it is a deep diving crankbait it is in gizzard shad and this thing goes down to 25 feet now here in south florida it's a bit difficult to fish these deep diving crankbaits considering the fact that most of our waterways here are about three to four feet deep uh and they are canals but uh, i am actually taking a trip to orlando and i know they have some deep lakes there so i might be able to actually get this in use and see if i can catch anything the paint on it is really really nice super realistic comes with vmc hooks take a look at that you guys this thing is pretty legit the paint on it is beautiful very very realistic the hooks super sharp jesus and as you can hear it has like marble sized bb's in this thing so it gives it a pretty wild rattling action. So that is the Jenko Fishing Deep Diving Crankbait. 25 feet, my gosh. Next up is one of my personal favorite. I love live target lures. I mean, I go to Dick's Sporting Goods and Bass Pro and I pretty much just cash out. These things are sick, you guys. Live target has the right idea when it comes to these soft plastic swim baits they make shad they make mullet they make all kinds golden shad they make all kinds of lures and they are just perfect the the action it gives a subtle subtle action to the tail it doesn't have some crazy flopping action to it if you guys ever use live targets you would know what i'm talking about the tail just slightly sputters across and it looks super realistic i've caught bass with this peacock bass with this snakeheads will destroy it it has the option of putting a treble at the bottom. It's just an overall perfect lure. I mean, you literally cannot go wrong with this. So, and it does come in different sizes. This one is the, I believe, this one is the four and a half inch. I know they do come bigger, but that is so awesome. I'm glad I can have another one of these. I have a few and I am putting this in my collection. So that is the live target thread fin shad in four and a half inch. Last, but not least, we have the Lunker Hunt Froglet. Now, I have a lot to say about this little lure here, you guys. Now, if you guys are a big fan of my channel or you guys have been keeping up with what I do, I love hollow body frogs. I mean, I have a lot of hollow body stuff. I have a big collection of hollow body frogs. So when I saw this, it really really popped out of me it is extremely interesting and i love the direction that lunker hunt went on this i know i'm pretty sure i know exactly what they were going for what the designers had in mind so let's take a closer look at this thing so it is your typical hollow body frog texture it feels the exact same and it has the same system hooks and weights as you can see it has the double hooks coming out from the bottom it has the hole in the front to tie your line and it has the weight down here but obviously as you can see it is elongated now I, this is the type of thing that you say wow i should have thought of that myself i'm assuming i don't know and do not quote me on this but i'm pretty sure they were going for the spook action and look now a thing with a frog it has a specific walk to it now this i'm pretty sure walks exactly like a spook it has those long side to side walking action and it's just genius i love this it i, I mean 
I hope they make this in all kinds of patterns. I hope maybe in the future they put some legs on it that come out. I, I don't know what they're going to do, but this is a really good start. I love this idea. It kind of brings the spook to a weedless action. So it's pretty much like a weedless spook at this point. So, I mean, that is just fantastic. And other than that, it's the same as the regular hollow body, hollow body frog. It probably moves a lot different than your typical original hollow body frog, but this gets me excited. So I cannot wait for this to be in the water and trying to get those snake heads with it. This is the Lunker Hunt Froglet. Last thing I'm gonna say about this, Lunker Hunt, good job. This is pretty sick. So that is it for August XL Bass Box. Again, this is this month we're going on big fish baits. We're trying to get, we're trying to target these big bass and all these baits are definitely capable of catching some lunkers out there. So to go over everything, the prices, the Threadfin Shad, the Live Target Shad costs $9.99. The Mustad Hooks cost $4.99. The Baitmate Ultra Live Nightcrawlers cost $5.99. The Bass Attacker Lizards cost $3.29. The Trapper Hooks cost $3. The Lunker Hunt Froglet cost $7.99. And the Jenko Fishing Deep Diving Crankbait cost $10.99, which gives you a grand total of $46.25. All for the price of $25. Bucks. So you're getting double the amount of baits and lures for $25. As always, everyone, thank you so much for watching, liking, commenting, and subscribing. And I will see you later.